Now, Barsa around knee joint. This is part 7. This is medial view and this is transverse section at the knee joint. Here, this is capsule of the joint. This is quadriceps femoris muscle, patella, ligamentum patelli. Here one bursa is present. And here another bursa is present. This is pre-patellar bursa. It lies just anterior to lower part of the patella. This is pre-patellar bursa. Pre-patellar bursa. And this is infra patellar bursa this is infra patellar bursa these two are present in the superficial fascia so these are subcutaneous so these are subcutaneous subcutaneous pre patellar and this is subcutaneous infra patellar bursa this Pre-patellar bursa enlarge in some cases. This is known as house-made knee. House-made knee. Then this pre-patellar bursa enlarge. This condition known as house-made knee. And if this is infected. Then it is known as minus beat me. Minus beat me. This is infrapatellar bursa. It enlarges into, it is known as clergyman. Clergyman's knee. And the bursa lies here here is synovial membrane which is like this this is synovial membrane and this forms suprapatellar bursa suprapatellar bursa and here one muscle is attached to apex of this bursa. This is this muscle is known as articular genu. This is articular genu. This muscle this muscle protects this bursa by pulling upward from crushing up the between these structures. So this is suprapatellar bursa. One bursa lies here. This is deep infrapatellar bursa. This is deep infrapatellar bursa. So an anterior aspect you have seen four bursa. This is subcutaneous prepatellar. This is subcutaneous infrapatellar. This is deep infrapatellar. This is suprapatellar bursa. So anterior aspect has four bursa. Now here you can see this transverse section. This is muscles which are related and posterior aspect of this. Knee joint, muscles and ligament. Here, one muscle is present. This is lateral head of the gastrocnemius. Lateral head of gastrocnemius. This is medial head of the gastrocnemius. This is plantaris. And this is biceps femoris. Here is semi membrosus.
This is chain view analysis. This muscle is sartorius. Sartorius. This is gracilis. And this is semi tendinosus. Here is tibial collateral ligament. This is tibial collateral ligament. Here lies fibular collateral ligament. Here is fibular collateral ligament. So now we'll discuss about the bursa related to this, these muscles here. Here one bursa is present. Deep to lateral head, one bursa between the condyle and lateral head of the gastronomus, one bursa is present here. This is biceps femoris between biceps femoris and fibular collateral ligament. There is one bursa here between fibular collateral ligament and under muscle. Popliteus, there is under bursa. So one bursa is lying here between this and popliteus muscle. And between popliteus muscle and the condyle, there is under bursa. So here lies under bursa. This is popliteus. Between popliteus and there is under bursa. Here popliteus position of the popliteus is here. Here it comes out through opening which lies on the posterior aspect. This is popliteus. Here it comes out. Otherwise its upper part is intracapsular. It lies within the capsule. Here it comes out and it between this and this lateral, uh, lateral condyle there is also a bursa. Here is one bursa. Here is one, two, three, four bursa. Total four bursa on lateral side, posterior lateral side. One is, lies deep to that head of the gastrodemus and there is between biceps femoris and fibular collateral ligament. And there is between fibular collateral ligament and popliteus, this, and between popliteus and lateral condyle, there is under bursa. This is total four bursa. And medial side. This is medial head of the gastronomus, there is one bursa. Deep to same minuses, there is under bursa. Here, deep to tibial collateral ligament. It has superficial and deep part. Tibial collateral ligament has superficial and deep part. Deep to this, the bursa is present. This is one bursa. And here is complicated bursa, which covers these three structures sartorius, gracilis, and semi tendinosus. This is ensarine bursa. It is like this. This is a bursa. If you see in the posterior view, this is here is tendon of sartorius, then gracilis, then semi tendinosus. Sartorius, gracilis, semi tendinosus. And here is bursa. This bursa lies like this. This is ensarine bursa. So this bursa is and serine bursa. This bursa is N serine bursa. So around the D joint, total 12 bursa present. This is anteriorly 4, posterior lateral 4, posterior medially 4 bursa. So this is all about the bursa related to knee joint. Thank you.